guys welcome back to my channel tonight we are going to be doing a mask and I picked this mask up from Ulta because Ulta had their philosophy pills and things on sale for half off so um, I picked up the detoxifying oxygen pill and it is a two-step system and it says it's for dullness, congested pores, and stressed skin. So, and I do have congested pores, and my skin is pretty stressed a little bit, so I can use some relaxing with my skin. So, let's see what else it says. It says, gently exfoliating peel combines two products in one to deliver the purifying benefits of an detoxifying mask with the brightening benefits of an oxygen facial sounds good sounds interesting all right so let's see let's open her up and see i have not used this yet this will be my first time so hopefully it doesn't bother my skin and it comes with the two tubes here. And it also comes with a, I think it's called Dermablade. It's like a little spatula. So this is the Dermablade. So that's what it comes with. I'll put that back there. And let's see. The first step is the black one here. And it says step one, de detoxifying charcoal gel that's what this one is and the white one here this is the step two and this is the oxygen foaming booster Ooh we okay so let's see let me read the directions to see how you apply it first okay directions step one apply a thick layer of the detoxifying charcoal gel that's the black one here and let's see on to clean skin and showing even applicate application do not rinse follow with step two okay so they want you to use the detoxifying charcoal gel first and they want you to put a thick layer on your skin and then you're supposed to put the oxygen foaming booster on top of it so and you're supposed to do it on clean skin so I already washed my makeup off as you can see and I use their purity space cleanser and I'm sure you can probably use any face cleanser, whatever you wash your face with, but I like, I do like their purity um, face cleanser. It gets all the makeup off. So I already cleaned my skin, take my glasses off. So, and what we're gonna do is we're going to go ahead and apply it. I think I need to open it. It does come sealed with a little paper on it, so. Take it off. See, don't you didn't open it. We're going to try this together and hopefully it doesn't bother my skin. Like I have dry, it's a little sensitive, and it says it's for all skin types. So, any, um, if you're dry or oily, you can use this, um, pill too as well. So, this is all skin types. So let's start with step one, the charcoal gel. Let's see what it looks like. I want to put it on my hand first. Ooh, it's black. It's black. Yes, it's black. Ooh, okay. So that's that one. Oops, I'm making a mess here. I'll be right back. I'm going to go get my brush. Okay, guys, I'm back. I went to get my little my little brush here. I wanted to brush it on. So I'm going to put 
just a little bit on my hands. I don't have anything to put it on. So I'm going to put it here and then just work my way my face. So let's start at my forehead. Ooh. Does it? It doesn't have a smell. It's okay. Just the put it here. And avoid, it did say avoid the eye area, your hair, your eyebrows. Eyebrows. <laughs> Don't put it on your brows. Okay, so it said put a thick layer, so I gotta use a lot of it. Okay, so I do have pores. I don't have big pores, but I notice sometimes that they're little. I can see them a little bit. That means that they congested. They need to be cleaned. I need a good clarifier. So hopefully it cleans my pores out. Especially like in my nose. That's where I see all that white stuff. You gotta use a lot of it to see it, a thick layer. This is my second. I really want to detoxify this. I'm looking in the mirror up here. I have I don't have blackheads. I may have like one or two. I know it's one on my forehead that I always have a hard time getting out. And it's like one over here on my cheek that won't come out. Okay. So, do the, put just a little bit, see if I can get it a little thicker. I do it that way. Oh yeah, I guess that's better. Put it here. Just don't get it on your hair. Put it on my nose because I know I have problems here on my nose. This is my first time using like a charcoal mask. I always see them in the store but I never tried one. I usually like to try and exfoliate my skin at least once, once a week to help get all the gooky stuff out of my pores. I don't wear makeup that often. Every so often I'll, I want to put a little makeup on and I don't cake my makeup on. I usually like a little natural a natural look. I see it not that often I wear makeup. I'm more of a, a lip gloss girl. <laughs> I like lip gloss. I love makeup. I see all the girls with the um, pretty makeup on and I'm not good at putting <laughs> makeup on but um, I just don't wear, wear that much of it. Okay I think that's on thick enough. This is what the charcoal gel look like. That's the first step here. It's this one. Now we're going to put the, let's call it, step two, oxygen foam booster. So we're going to put that one on. Put this on my hand. Let's see what this one, oops, I'm going to take the top off here. This comes with a little paper. One here. Whoa. Okay. Get back there. This one come on out. Put that right there. Okay, I'm just going to put that much. This one is white. So I'm gonna put it, it says you're supposed to put it on top of this one here. 
in circular motions. Oh, so it turns like a gray color, of course. It doesn't have a smell or anything. It feels light. See how it's turning like a charcoal color. Put it on my nose. If you guys do mask, um, it will be nice to hear what kind of mask you guys do. And if you do it once a week, twice a week because I don't have one that I really like yet. So if you guys have any suggestions, list them down in the subscription box for me and I'll try them. Don't get it on your lips. Make sure you get your chin. This is where I usually have all that a little white hits or something on my chin. Okay. It's turning gray. Oh, you know what? I see it foaming up. It's like a foam. It turns into a foam. Okay. See how it's turning? I don't know if you can see it. It's like turning into a foam. Okay, so that's enough of that. And let's see how long you're supposed to leave it on for. Ha, ha. Don't have my glasses here. I don't want to put my glasses on. Yeah. Let's see. How long do you supposed to leave it on for? Why didn't I read the whole box before? Okay, three minutes. You're supposed to leave it on for, it says three minutes. Leave on for three minutes. Remove by using the the spatula, the Dermablade spatula. Okay, so let me go look at the clock, and I'm going to keep this on. I think I'm going to keep it on a little bit longer than three minutes. I'm going to do five minutes. Okay, if I feel anything weird or anything, then I'll come back and let you know. We're, I'll start taking it off, but... I'm going to keep it on for five minutes on the, on the directions. It did say leave on for three minutes. Right now, it feels fine. I don't feel any burning or anything. So, let's see how it does with the, um, the three minutes. I'm sure right now, it's been already, what, a minute or two? So, I Hello, guys. I am back. And let's see. It's already been five minutes that I had my mask on and it feels comfortable. It's not like really tight or anything, my skin. It's, um, it is there, but it's not like super tight. You have, if you know some of the masks, most of the times they get like really, really tight and you can't move your face. You like talking like that, but it's, it's not, it's not tight. It feels, still feels soft or whatever. I'm thinking that I didn't put it on thick enough because it said put thick layer on. I put like a medium, like um, I didn't put enough on. So, because when you put it on thick and then you get ready to use the, the um, microderm, the little blade here, the spatula, you're supposed to be able to scrape it off and which... See, I can't scrape it off because I didn't put it on that thick. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wet a washcloth here and I'm just going to put the cloth over my face and then kind of like steam it. It's like a steam. I wish I had my steamer and did order a steamer. That would be good. Then you could just sit under the steamer and steam steam um, the mask. But 
I'm gonna use my washcloth here to wipe it off. Okay, so you can hear the water running. And my water is warm. And I'm letting my washcloth really well. Get it like that. And it's warm, so I'm gonna take and cover my face. You see that sting? Mm. 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 That off. See if it works with me. Ah, see? That works now. Let's try that. Let's turn the water off. Take my spatula here and and scrape it. See I like that. Okay. So I just damped it, damped the cloth a little bit, and that helped. Ooh. Ooh. Feels good. I got I had a a nice facial and this all the I'm gonna rinse that off. Like little pieces and stuff like but yeah. It's there. I'm gonna do this side. Let goofy stuff off. Get my battery stuff to run out. It's hard to get the nose. The nose area, that's the part that I, I really want to get. Do my forehead. So I'm gonna take my cloth and I'm just gonna damp it really good. It's like warm, it's warm water. And I'm just squeezing it out gently. And then I'm gonna lay it over top of my forehead. Go again. Oh, that feels good. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna scrape my forehead. And the sides here. Okay. And do this side. Wonder did I get that little black head that I had up here? The top. I look in the mirror and see. Well, anyway, it feels good. I don't know if it did anything, but face feel nice and clean, of course. And then what I'll do, I'll just take the washcloth and just wipe the rest of it away. Okay. 
like that. What do you think, guys? What do you think? It feels nice. Nice and relaxing. Just letting a different mask to do. Feels good. There we go. Hmm. Let me look in my little mirror and see. Here's my little... I like to look in this mirror and I can see if I... Ooh. Yeah, I did get all the stuff out of my pores. My pores do look smaller. And here's that little black hair that I had right here. It was a tiny one. Oops, and I just wiped it away. Yep. Guys, I like this mask. It feels nicely. Okay, so get under your eye. So what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to, that feels nice. And it's supposed to help when you give yourself a nice facial, a nice mask, and then when you go and you put your serums and your creams on, it absorb in your skin much better. So that is, that is a nice mask. I like that one. So, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go and I'm going to put my serums and everything on and go to bed. So anyway, thank you for watching. And if you try this little kit here, just send me a message and let me know if you guys liked it. Um, but I like it. feel like it cleaned all that stuff that I had on the side of my nose out. And that little black hair right there. Alrighty guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Have a good night. Bye.